The old man, yeah. Oh, the adventure log. Here. Uh, no. Give me... Shrine, main... Oh, no. We have to scroll up. Oops. Okay. Destroy Ganon. Yeah, let's go. No. Um, let's see. Locked mementos. Prove... Oh. We're already here. Cool. So let's just glide back down. Hey, Impa. Give me some mementos of the locked kind. That's why we were going here in the first place, but thankfully we already found the fairy fountain. Hey, Impa. Share with me your knowledge. Your ever so graceful knowledge. Locked mementos complete. Now then, let me see. You see? It's it's a retina display. This is without a doubt the camera the Princess Zelda used a hundred years ago. Wow. That's a... That's a... a, a what's the name of that phone brand? Not, 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 not an icon. Nokia. Nokia. That's a Nokia camera phone there. Caption memories. New objective. Um... What? It's a, it tells me to go back there. You may not remember your last meeting with Ganon, but it did not end well for you. Well, I don't think so, because I was dead for a hundred years. Uh, if you want a different outcome this time around, you need to be properly equipped. Um... Oh, that tells you the story again. All right, can I skip this? I'm sorry, I forgot. Yeah, skip it. Cool. I already know what happens. So, now we just need to go and do the, uh, the Divine Beast thing. I don't know in what particular order, because there we go. Uh, let's see. So, memory. Princess Zelda left behind an album with 12 pictures in it. Traveling to those places will help you regain your memories of the princess. Okay. So, we could do those 12 memories. We're not going to do that right now, because I don't feel like it. Uh, there are four divine beasts. Okay. So I think this is just the main quest now. I think this is this is it. Uh, Gerudo, there's there. Um, is that one? Is this guy? I forget which one I've done the most research. I think it's this one. Right? Maybe. Yeah, it has to be this one. Let's go here. So let's try this divine beast. Um. I don't know if there's a specific order you're supposed to do these in, but, I mean, we tried doing the Gerudo Tower one. We can't get in there, and you can get in there one of two ways, either by uh, cross-dressing, which I've seen an article on, which is pretty interesting, or we do that quest whatever. I don't quite know, but let's go and try out this Divine Beast and see if we can, uh, see if we can go and do the, do the beast and... Do the thing. I have seen only one of the beasts that we complete. Oh, it's really cold. Okay. Um, that's not good. So I need to go... What am I doing? Here. Uh, which way am I going? Oops. I did that totally wrong. Hopefully I don't completely freeze to death. Am I going the right way? No, I'm not. This way? It's this way. Okay, cool. Literally. Cool. I wonder if I should tell. I'm gonna teleport back to the top of the tower. Because I totally messed that up. Okay. <laughs> I love. I, lo I love two, two things. I love that Link is constantly shivering. Even when he's gliding down, he's like, you know, chomping his teeth away. But you can just teleport at any given point. I know I mentioned that before. But you can just teleport when you're flying through the air. And, like magic. It's just like magic. It's great. So let's try that one more time. Here we go. Herba Tower. Heba, Hebra Tower. Okay. So I need to go this way. Perfectly in this direction. Preferably if I get to that, uh... Oh, we're doing the flying one. Cool. Oh, am I wearing the tunic? Yeah, I am. I can change my clothes in midair. Watch this, kids. Uh, let's see. Can I equip this? Um, 
Yeah, that's, do that's doing cold resistance, but not quite well enough here. Here we go. Just eat all the apples. There we go. So you can still buy more, like, you know, warm clothes for Link. Like, you can get the special abilities with the elixirs and stuff, but I just haven't... I haven't done it. Um... We should be getting off this mountain soon. But hopefully soon enough so I don't freeze to death and have these guys not... I'm doing the glitch. I don't care. Oh, we're walking even more slowly because we're in the snow. Oh, great. Awesome. Just go, Link. Go faster. There we go. Now we're not in the... Uh... There we go. Now we're not in the snow anymore. So where specifically... Oh, yeah. This is the one I was thinking of. Okay. So we should go to that shrine first. At least to activate it. I I believe you can activate... Ooh. We could dive and do that that seed. I also got a, cork, a lot of croak seeds. Croak cro croak? I still can't pronounce that. I've gotten a bunch of the seeds. That way we can get our inventory expanded even further when we are actually able to. So here we go. We need to find the guy that can get us inside of there. Because as much as the game is like, Oh, you can go anywhere, wherever you want at any given time. You can't go up there. You still can't quite fly. There's no bird that's going to come out of the sky and save us for this one. So keep that in mind. Uh, so, And I've seen only one of the four Divine Beasts actually in action. And what they do. And it's super duper cool. And I won't necessarily spoil it, but like it's it's super super interesting how they do it. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. Now I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh, wait, go. Now I'm gonna die. Nice, sweet, awesome, great. No, that's fine. I get it. No, it's great. That's fine. All right, now we gracefully land. Boom. And now we're in the redwood floor, <laughs> the redwood florist. <laughs> oh, my lack of enunciating words properly gets me once again the redwood florist area of Rito Village. Hello. Hello, Mr. Birdman. Hmm, are you a traveler? Everyone asks me if I'm a traveler. Where am I? This is Rito Village, but what you could say we're not in a welcoming mood. Talk to the folks at the village to hear all about it. Any other questions? What's going on, man? Meow meow. You see that beast in the sky? That's Divine Beast Vamado. Vamado. Come on, Vamanos. They say he used to be a divine being that protected the village, but it doesn't seem very divine to me. Thankfully, the thing shoots at anything flying high above. <laughs> only shoots at things. It only shoots at things like birds flying high above the village. So it's pretty demoralizing for us, Rito, to have to fly so low to the ground. Oh, yes. Any other questions? Nah, fam. I'm good. Don't let me keep you. I certainly won't. So maybe there's some super cool uh, uh, items I can get here. Hey, can you help me out? You have conquered the shrines and claimed spirit orbs. I will take a heart container. Yeah, I do. I should grant you the power you seek. Cool. And I believe there's one of these in Kakariko Village, too. So we can go back there and get ourselves another heart container. Yay! Now we're up to four hearts. Sweet. It appears you still possess spirit orbs. Ooh, we can keep exchanging them? Yeah, I want another heart container. Cool. We're going, we double, we almost doubled our heart container amount in one episode. Would you look at that, ladies and gentlemen? Ooh, we can still get more. It doesn't max out. I thought it would. We have doubled our heart container amount in one episode. Would you look at that? Fantastic. Yeah, give me more. Cool. Well, it was weird that when we did, um, we did, like, the Kurok, the Kurok seeds, and it only let us do, like, two upgrades. Look at that. Seven hearts now. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous. So now, let's find out what we gotta do. Where's our, uh, 
Where's our buddy here? Is he down here? No, he's way up top. And I fell down for no reason. It looks like he's way down below. But nope. Okay. Ooh, there's a shop. But I don't care. Uh, show me some clothing. Hello. What do you do? Ooh, the cold resistance is real. All right. So, okay. The snow quill headdress. And we could get this all upgraded too and it could be really cool. Um, I really like this middle one. I'm gonna go with this. I'll take it. Thank you. That's how you shop. Yeah, you bet, buddy. You bet. Uh, we don't need it right now. But, oh no, we could technically get rid of this stupid tunic. This infamous tunic. Because we don't need it anymore. Um, cool. Now we are... Now we're kicking it. Look at that. That's a beautiful looking getup right there. Now that is... That's actually gorgeous. So now let's go to the tip top of the mountain. Where's our bird friend? Oh, our birdie! Want me to tell you a story? I guess. I got nothing else to do. Miss uh, Tweety Bird over here. Once upon a time, my grandpa stopped a big tree. Stopped at a big tree while he was climbing down a big mountain. Um, saw a huge white s snow white birdie. Okay, something super important. The birdie has swallowed. I was going to sleep you around that part of the story so I don't remember. <laughs> Oops. I know where the big tree is, though. Where's the big tree? Oh, of course it is. It's at the top of the mountain. Grandpa said he saw that Snow White birdie from that tree. Aww. Hmm. Maybe, now, what did that Snow White birdie swallow? I can't hear the story from Grandpa anymore. Aw. The bird in the mountains. Well, it looks like we may just need to, uh... To get the rest of that clothing ensemble here. Oh no, that's an inn. We don't want to do that. I know what it does now. It gives you like a little bit more, uh, uh, like an extra heart container. But considering we already doubled our heart container amount, I don't think we need to do that. I'm going to sell some stuff. Hey, hey Fredo. Thanks for coming by. What can I do for you? I'm looking to sell, sell, sell. Um, where the valuable goods at? I'll sell like half of these. There we go. Take it for 180 rupees. I need to cook some stuff too. I need to really prepare before I go out and do this whole thing. I don't know why I did <laughs> selecting three and then did all of them. Let's see. Go. Oh, the topaz. Get rid of it. I don't know what these are for. They're kind of valuable, so I probably shouldn't get rid of them. Yeah, I definitely need to cook before I head out. Um, I got a thousand rupees now. No, that just gets me this thing. Cost you a thousand rupees, yep. Cool. That's perfect for you. Yeah, you bet. I'll do this. Still like my cap of the wind. Alright. I need 550. Alright, looking to sell. Sell, 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 sell! Uh, I'll get rid of all these. Whatever. I keep doing that. Get rid of three of them. All of them. Just get them all out of my way. Out of my way. Uh, can we sell... We can sell articles of clothing. Oh, for 15. Nice. Ooh, Sheik's Mask. It gets you... Oh, no. The Climber's Bandana gets you a lot. Um, none of that stuff. Ah, man. I guess we can't get it right now. Okay. So... Our shrine quest is, like, way up here. But our still, our objective is still this little girl up here. This little Tweety Bird. Do you have, are you withholding information, good, good madam? Is that what you're doing? Ah, I'm exhausted. So tired. So tired. Okay. I guess not. Let's see. Ooh, the shrine. Let's do this shrine, that way we can unlock this as a transportable location. Ak, vuk, I can't even, pr I'm not pronouncing that. It's a shrine, and that's all that matters. Cool. What puzzles shall await us this time? Ooh, windmills. 
Oh, this should be fun. Let's see. Ooh. Oh, we gotta get them all spinning. Oh, it's a grid. Oh, this is gonna take me a while, boy. Well, luckily, that's that's the whole puzzle, so. Oh, that did it. Cool. So, I'll show you what, what I did. That way, in case anybody's watching and, like, actually following along with what I'm doing. This is how you solve the puzzle. Get a good look at it right here. This is how it's all laid out. Alright, pause the video if you need to. But otherwise, let's continue on with this shrine here. That was pretty interesting. That wasn't an overly long one, but you kind of had to think outside of the box to, to get it done. And that's what I like. When the, when the puzzles aren't aggravating, they just are uh, 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 mind twisters. So... That's pretty interesting. And then the gods will smile upon you. With the spirit orb, we could get even eight heart containers coming up pretty soon here. That will, uh, that'll be pretty good too. Um, even though we're getting to the point now where, uh, the enemies are much more powerful and one-hit KOs are still a thing, even though we are doubling our amount of heart containers, so that's that. The stamina... I'm not going to be upgrading any further, because there's a particular reason you got to get eight heart contain- or no, you need to get a certain amount of heart containers to get to the thing and the thing, so yeah, cool. Um, what's this? That's clothing. Still can't do that. Too bad you can't sell weapons, that'd be really cool. So she's not here, right? No. She would be literally right there. So I guess we should go to the top of the mountain to find the tree. Where's the tree? That tree right there, right? That one single lonely tree. Right there. And I guess that's the shrine that we need to go to. So, cool. I guess next episode, that's what we're going to be doing. So I want to thank you guys and girls for listening and watching to this episode of Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. We're going to get to that tree and see what's up there. Hope you have a great day. There's a bird. Oh, why not bad, bad, bird? Bad, bad, bird. I'll talk to you next time. See you later. Bye.